nations have made it onto a very prestigious list, the New York Times list of the 52 places to visit this year. Tasmania's place was secured with its wild landscapes, Indigenous cultural activities and for being a foodie hotspot. Yeah, Brisbane also made the cut alongside cities like Paris, Vienna and Singapore. And no surprise there, I'm sure Brisbane B105 Stav Davidson would agree. That's where Brisbane belongs. Stav, did the New York Times get it right, popping Brisbane where it did? Well, what a compliment to get from the city that doesn't sleep for the city that likes its naps. Uh, yes, uh, it is great to be recognised. I wish this article came out maybe a few months ago so that Taylor Swift would have read it and she would have come to Brisbane yeah. as well. Um, but kudos to you guys for doing a story about coming to Brisbane just before showing a photo of a massive snake that's going to really want to bring people down under. <laughs> Look, that's a big draw card, right? Yeah. Sure. 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 Check out the bar, you know, look past the snake. Have a drink with Pete. Um, no. Now, the Times says that one of the reasons to visit is because Brisbane's undergoing a facelift. Was there anything wrong with how the city looked before? Well, uh, I think that Brisbane is a city that's been quietly growing up over the last 10 to 15 years. And, yeah, there are definitely things that have popped. Even so, when I go out nowadays, I'm like, oh, this is actually cool. Like, Howard Street Wharfs is a fantastic place to go. Yeah. Uh, it's the only city I know that's got access to the Sunshine Coast and the Gold Coast. We thought that wasn't good enough and built a beach in the middle of town. Um, <laughs> so there's plenty of stuff to do when you get here. Is this, do you think, the year that Brisbane really shines for international visitors? I think it could be, and I think a lot of that would have to be down to uh, the, the uh, Soccer World Cup that we had here really shone a spotlight on Brizzy when it was here. And uh, I think, actually, the only thing really wrong with Brisbane at the moment is all the uh, Sydney and Melbourne people moving up here. <laughs> <laughs> Get used to it. Um, what are your travel tips for people heading to Brizzy? Uh, I would say if you don't like the heat, book a hotel with air conditioning because it has yeah. been extremely hot here. Uh, and also the air guard for the mosquitoes. Um, but it's, it's actually, it's a really easy city to get around. It's good public transport. There's only one uh, motorway in and out. So you, you really can't get lost. And if you do get lost, you're going to end up somewhere cool anyway. Yeah, you'll be on the yeah. Sunshine Coast or the Gold Coast. Either exactly. way, you can't go wrong. Exactly. Yeah. Stav, we love it. Uh, thanks very much. Thanks for selling your beautiful city. And uh, we'll see you soon. Appreciate no it. No worries. Thank you for having me. Yep, people make it too. Thank yep. you.